Here on Indian Trace, welcome to the Backside Cove. As you can see, <laughs> they planted all this tobacco, and the sun's rising strong there. This is before work. Uh, planted all this tobacco, which is just fine with me, a little while back, on this ancient Indian site. <laughs> of course, if they didn't plant all this tobacco on this ancient Indian site, there'd be none of this. That is, finding. Now, you tuned in because usually on Indian Trace I find something sweet just because uh, <laughs> God's faithful. Uh, and uh, I'm walking up here just checking these washed out rows that they double turned. And uh, I believe with the sun the way it is, I see some great flaking on a piece of sugar quartz. Can't tell where the sun is so bright. There it is. And I looked at it and I said, I believe that's a lance point. Might be a Guilford round, and I know it's sugar quartz. Catch it. Unmistakable, right? And it's over two inches. So, might as well jump right off and start finding something. And I think it's a Guilford round. of beauty. It's quiet out here, isn't it? I mean, you're looking. Whew, that's a nice piece. Let me check the tip first. It's beveled. It's all there. Nice piece, though. Nice piece. Look at that. Whew. Just wanted to document that today. I mean, we got this going on. Sun's bright. Right here in the tobacco. Let me see if I can get this in the shade if it's any better. Sugar quartz for sure. It's got a real spin on it. It's beveled. We got full edge right here where my thumb is. It's not cleaned up. But a nice piece nonetheless. You gotta love these lance point types. Just would have done the job. Don't know if you could see it. You could see the shape in the relief off the back. Looks like a little bit of a Guilford Yuma, to be honest. Anyway, that's what you're finding out here. I had to jump out in Backside Cove and see what was going on, and it came right out of here. So I'll put it right there. We'll finish it off right in the sun. Whew. Appreciate you tuning in to Indian Trace.